exactly what I came to ask you. How dare you humiliate Cruz the way you did this morning? Stumbling in here after you spend the night with another man, Santana? I don't know what you're talking about. You're a liar. You spent the night with Keith Timmons in the presidential suite, didn't you? I know all about women like you, Santana. You're no better than a common slut. Don't talk to me that way. You have no right barging into my home and saying these things to me. Look, you may be able to keep Cruz feeling guilty over nothing so you can play around with Keith Timmons, but it's not going to work with me. I'm not here to put a bid in on your husband, Santana. I'm here because I can't stand to see someone as trusting and as honest as him being hurt by someone like you. And I am going to do him the purely selfless favor of getting rid of a spouse who not only doesn't care about him, but hurts him every time she turns around. The same way that he helped me get rid of Kirk. What do you mean? What are you going to do? I'm going to expose you for what you really are. I have suspected you and Keith of something for weeks now, but I was never 100% sure. But you want to know what? I have proof. How? What am I going to do with it? You're bluffing. You can't have. Well, I guess you'll just have to wait and see, won't you? But you want to know what? I'm not the kind of person that wants to hurt people, Santana. I'm not like you. I'll make a deal with you. What kind of deal? You pack your things and you leave. You leave Cruz and you leave Brandon by tomorrow morning. Then you can have your little affairs with Keith Timmons on every street corner as far as I'm concerned. You just promise to leave Cruz alone. You do that... And I will not tell him what I know. Silence gives a sense, Santana. I better hear by tomorrow that you're gone. You make sure that you are.